Once Upon a Time When We Were Colored, a 1989 memoir by Clifton Talbert takes readers on a journey through the author's upbringing as an African-American in a small Mississippi town during the racially segregated 1950s. Talbert's narrative spans from his early years until his move to the North, shortly before turning 18, shedding light on the challenging political, socioeconomic, and racial climate that African Americans faced during this period. The book, which earned a Pulitzer Prize, later inspired a 1996 film adaptation of the same name. It all begins in Glen Allen, Mississippi, where Talbert was born to a young single mother named Mary Talbert. For the first five years of his life, he was under the care of his great-grandparents, Pearl and Joe Young, whom he affectionately called Mama Pearl and Papa. However, when Mama Pearl fell terminally ill, Talbert moved in with his grandaunt, Ma Punk, and lived with her until completing high school. Throughout the memoir, Talbert offers vivid recollections of Mississippi, particularly its African-American community, which profoundly influenced his identity and perspective. As a young boy, he attended a Ku Klux Klan rally with Papa, experiencing the virulent hostility of the white participants and prompting him to question their ideology. Growing up in a segregated, impoverished, and rural neighborhood, most adults in his community worked as field laborers for white landowners. Talbert attended a one-room schoolhouse alongside the children of illiterate field workers, black servants, and housekeepers. The local church, where most residents worshipped and organized politically, played a pivotal role in their lives. Ma Punk actively participated in the church and sang in the gospel choir. Talbert found numerous role models within this community, and the church played a crucial role in his development as a diligent and principled young man. When Talbert entered the workforce, he worked for a white woman named Ms. Mavery, who nurtured his love for reading by providing books from the local library. His favorite book, Homer's Iliad, inspired a passion for classical literature. The memoir is punctuated with various childhood memories, some carrying significant political weight. Notably, Talbert recounts attending church meetings where the church deacon, Joe Maxey, declared his intention to drive to Baltimore for an NAACP conference. The church community united in their efforts to advance racial justice in Mississippi and nationally. The pursuit of racial justice ultimately motivated Talbert to leave Mississippi as he graduated from high school, anticipating a fresh start in the North. Once Upon a Time when We Were Colored is an intimate reflection on a particular period and place in African American history, marked by racism but also filled with hope for a brighter future. It paints a vivid picture of the challenges, resilience, and the significance of community during a pivotal era in American history. I hope you enjoyed this video, leave a like if you did, and be sure to subscribe thank you.